Good morning, Your Honor. May it please the court, I respectfully request that I be allowed to attend this morning's online Zoom hearing as my alter ego, Lawyer Dog. <laughs> this is a community-supported legal education channel. Find out how you can support our mission at the links in the description below. Yesterday, Judge Roy Ferguson of the 394th Judicial District of Texas posted this important Zoom tip. If a child used your computer before you join a virtual hearing, check the Zoom video options to make sure filters are off. This kitten just made a formal announcement on a case in the 394th. Mr. Ponton, I believe you have a filter turned on in the video settings. Uh, you might want to uh, uh, take, take we're a trying look. to we're tr can you hear me judge I can hear you I think it's a filter it, in the it is and I don't know how to remove it I've got my assistant here she's trying to but uh, I'm prepared to go forward with it that's I'm here live that's not I'm not a cat I can I can see that. Although the judge's placard notes that recording of this hearing or live stream is prohibited and a violation may constitute contempt of court and a result in a jail fine of up to $500 and a jail term of up to 180 days, the judge did post this video himself, saying that media outlets may use the video. It was recorded during a virtual hearing of the 394th District of Texas and is released for educational purposes. The judge asks not to mock the lawyer but instead to be used to exemplify the legal community's dedication to the cause of justice. And I'd like to note that these lawyers were probably confused not by Zoom's video filters, but rather by Snapchat's video filters. This is actually a rather complicated technical issue. It turns out that in order to get these filters, you have to install Snap Camera, which then creates a virtual camera, which is then piped into your Zoom video sources. And if you don't know that you even have Snap Camera installed, you wouldn't know how to turn off the filter. Hence, the lawyer says that he's prepared to go forward with the filter on. I'm prepared to go forward with it. That's, I'm here live, that's not, I'm not a cat. And definitely pay close attention to Attorney Phillips in the upper right corner as Attorney Ponton, who is reluctantly appearing as Lawyer Kitten in the bottom right, says, I am not a cat. I'm prepared to go forward with it. That's, I'm here live, that's not, I'm not a cat. I can I can see that. Um, I think if you click the up arrow next to the judge Ferguson goes on to say that these fun moments are a byproduct of the legal profession's dedication to ensuring that the justice system continues to function in these tough times. Everyone involved handled it with dignity and the filtered lawyer showed incredible grace. True professionalism all around. And that's the major lesson here. The lawyers are often spending their time learning the law and how to argue and present to the judge, and oftentimes technology literacy falls by the wayside. And this situation really couldn't even be attributed to technology illiteracy. How could this lawyer really have known that Snap Camera was installed, was connected through Zoom, had a filter applied, and going to the options in Zoom and turning off the filter would have done nothing to solve the issue. Ultimately, the solution is to change your Zoom camera source back to the actual camera instead of the snap camera. But if you're not aware of how to do that, you end up being a lawyer dog for the entire hearing. And so we should offer our kudos to the lawyers and the judge involved who were able to handle the situation professionally. And I don't know how it played out, whether there was actually a workaround or whether the lawyer appeared as lawyer kitten for the entire hearing. But in these trying times where we are attempting to appear before judges and persuade judges and juries and even opposing parties using only our virtual presence, especially when lawyers are trained and experienced at being persuasive more in person than online, it's commendable for lawyers to do everything they can to adapt.
Whenever I speak to any of my colleagues, the sentiment is the same, trying to adapt to these new technological hurdles. Issues of persuasion and presence are a common sentiment all around. So this is a great opportunity to have a good laugh at the unwitting lawyer kitten's expense. But this is not an attempt to mock, but rather a showing that sincerely doing your best in front of the judge is really enough to forward the interests of justice and the dignity of the parties, even when there are technical problems, uh, as the judge says, in these tough times. So here, please enjoy one last play of this video, and I'll link to the original release by Judge Ferguson below. Mr. Ponton, I believe you have a filter turned on in the video settings. Uh, you might want to uh, uh, take, take We're a trying look. to, we're tr can you hear me, Judge? I can hear you. I think it's a filter. It, in the it is, and I don't know how to remove it. I've got my assistant here. She's trying to, but uh i'm prepared to go forward with it that's i'm here live that's not i'm not a cat i can i can see that thank you for watching i'm leonard french your favorite copyright attorney and this is lawful masses your favorite legal news and education channel here on youtube you can also find us on floatplane and on twitch.tv slash lawful masses on sunday mornings at 10 a.m our channel is community supported by your monthly financial contributions on patreon.com slash ljfrench, sponsors.com slash law, through YouTube memberships, and through Floatplane subscriptions. Thank you to the following $50 plus supporters in the month of February. Joe Tyson, John Steele, Gavin Barnard, Kyle Mudrock, Evie, Spirit Bear, Andy, Benjamin Hightoff, Ugly Grill, Shiloh T, Rudolph Bescherer Jr., Oscar the Prophet, Brandon Abel, Torpedon, Sovereign Titison, Shadow Tycho, Earthbound Star, RDH Dragon, Nathan McCarty, and Winter Grill. And thank you as well to the $5 plus supporters who are scrolling on your screen. I hope everyone has a great week. I will see you in the videos that drop. I love you all. Bye. I'm not a cat.